Getting back to power, there's a second part of power, which is the charging. Right now, there are 1,100 supercharger stations in America. What is a supercharger station? Well, those of you that know Teslas, you know exactly what they are. There are these big charging units that are white and red. You pull up to them and it's got very high voltage. You plug into your car and within less than an hour, within an hour, you can get about an 80% charge. Well, since you can go about 300 miles or more with these cars now, go in and have a bite to eat in about 45 minutes, you come out and your car is charged 80%. That's kind of the design, it's where they're set up. Well, the supercharger stations are joined now with what's called destination chargers. Destination chargers are those small gray boxes that you've seen that may be at a Holiday Inn or at a Marriott Courtyard or at a, you know, amusement park or a mall. These are destinations around town and 4,000 destination chargers and 1,100 superchargers, about 5,000 locations in the U.S. And if you count all the outlets, all the extension cords, if you will, there's about 20,000 of them, which they claim covers 99% of the U.S. population. So what, Tom? What are we getting to here? I think there's something hidden. And recently, he leaked a tweet, Mr. Musk did, and talked about it's low-key, but yes, we are working with another auto manufacturer to use these. Wait a minute. So he built 5,000 of these outlets here, another 1,000 superchargers in Europe and Asia. So basically, he has built a gas station featuring electricity. So if you're not paying attention, there are people that are going to take their credit card, put it on an account, and they're going to fill up their GM or their Toyota or their Nissan electric, or their Porsche Taycan, and they're going to fill it up at Elon Musk's gas station. And if you don't think he's gonna make a buck on that, you're not paying attention. This is what I was talking about back in 2017. I said, listen, I think he's gonna have an energy footprint that is envious of people, and they're gonna be coming to him. The issue is gonna be, as the number of uh, electric vehicles increases out on the road, this may not be enough, and it won't be. People will still be charging at their home. And so they have announced that 2021 is going to be a crazy aggressive year for supercharger builds in the United States, making this footprint denser and denser. And then on one day, it won't matter what you buy because you'll pull into the Tesla gas station to put those volts into your car. Okay, that's power. Thanks for watching the short clip. If you like that and would like to see the whole episode, you can find it right here. And for even more, subscribe to this channel right here.